Hello, my name is James. Welcome to this tutorial, uh, which is aimed at around about A-level standard. And the question says, uh, 0.58 mole of hydrogen iodide was heated and the following equilibrium established. The equilibrium mixture contained 0.04 mole of hydrogen. Calculate Kc. So let's write an expression for Kc and identify the problem. Kc being the uh, concentration of the things on the right divided by the concentration of the things on the left. But we're only given the equilibrium amount of the hydrogen H2 there, not the other two. So the data we're, we're given is that initially there's 0.58 mole of the hydrogen iodide, and we'll assume none of the hydrogen and the iodine. And at equilibrium, 0.04 mole of the hydrogen. Now we want to know the equilibrium amounts of the other two species so we can put that data into this equation and work out Kc. So to do that we want to ask by what amounts has each substance changed? So for the hydrogen that has uh, increased by 0.04 mole uh, which would mean that for the iodine that would also have increased by 0.04 mole. For the hydrogen iodide, because these are in a 2 to 1 ratio, the amount by which the hydrogen iodide has changed must have been 0 0.08. must have gone down by 0 0.08 to form the hydrogen and the iodine. So there we've worked out the equilibrium mole amounts of all three substances. We can carry on and write out the expression for Kc again and put the values in there. And here we've got our answer for Kc, and that's a correct answer. The units don't quite work out because uh, these values are in mole, whereas when you're talking about uh, Kc, we're defining concentration, which is mole per unit volume. However, we could put in uh, each of those mole amounts and divide it by the volume, which we'll call V, for the hydrogen there, for the iodine here, and for the hydrogen iodide, and we will see that there are two volumes on the top, two on the, vo on the bottom, and so those volumes cancel out. And that's why this answer here is correct. It's also why there are no units for that value of Kc. So just to conclude here, if the ratio of reactants and product is not one to one throughout, then the change in the number of moles must match the ratio. So here we see the change values there, 0 0.08, 0 0.04, 0 0.04, they match a 2 to 1 to 1 ratio. Second point, if Kc is, it's, Kc is defined in terms of concentrations, i.e. mole divided by volume, however, the V terms, if they cancel, we don't, do not need to know the actual volume, and in this case, the V terms did cancel. Okay, and finally, uh, a small puzzle here. It says work out the equilibrium amounts where you're given an equation which is in a 1 to 1 to 2 ratio and the initial moles you're given there. Given the equilibrium uh, mole of one of the substances, so uh, you've been asked to work out the equilibrium amounts of A and B. And then would the volumes cancel in the definition of Kc here? Okay, thanks for watching and bye for now.